hello everyone welcome to this tutorial in this video we are going to see that how can we set a gif as a background in our google chrome new tab in google so right now i have opened up a new tab in my google chrome browser and you can see in the background i am getting a gray background which is uh, not very visually appealing if i want i can just uh, change its theme i can just customize it to any color that i want or i can just uh, use some of the pre-built themes like uh, some of the abstract arts that are already provided to us by google but these are all the static images that we are using what happens if we want to use a gif so if you just go to this edit icon then you will see that there is no option if you just even go to change theme then there is no option where we can use a gif we can use static images only we can use different kinds of static images but only the static images are available for us to use so how are we gonna add a gif then so for this what we are going to do is first of all download a gif that we are going to use so what is the easiest way to download a gif that's what i'm going to show you first so first what you need to do is go to images over here so that you are only able to search the images then here type the gif that you want suppose i want a gif for a waterfall so just type in a waterfall now what happens is you can see there are static images and there might be some gifs over here so we want to filter the records filter the images so only gifs are visible to us so how are we going to do this so the simple step is you go to tools and here you will find other uh, so many options like size color type time usage rights etc so i'm just going to change the type to a gif so now all the gifs will be loaded and uh, in the usage rights, I'm just going for Creative Commons license so that there is no license issue and I can just actually freely download and use that particular uh, GIF. So let's just uh, take the GIF that you like the most and wait for a few seconds for it to load. So uh, let us just see uh, when this GIF starts working for us. So like this GIF, uh, the bird is flying and the waterfall is happening. So this looks good to me. So I'm just going to right click over here and go to save image as. Now you can save the image anywhere you want. But whatever the name of the image is, just make sure to add a .png after it. Doesn't matter if its type is GIF, but add a .png at the end. And click on save. Now it is not a mandatory requirement that you uh, go for a waterfall GIF only. You can just go with any GIF that you like. Suppose if you want, uh, if you are a fan of Matrix movie, you can just uh, go for Creative Commons GIFs for that particular movie. And here, uh, dot .gif would be written over here so that you would be able to understand that okay, it is a GIF. So you can just open that GIF and wait for a few seconds for it to load. So we can just. Uh, go through many of the gifs that are over there and from there we can just select a gif that uh, we think is better for us and then we can just download it and apply it onto our screen now once your image is saved open up a new tab then go to this edit icon go to change theme go to upload an image now here you need to just select your gif so in my case this is my gif of the waterfall once you have selected it click on open and here you can see that your GIF has been added, but its dimensions have been different because it has been zoomed a bit much and the pixels are all showing like this disturbed. So I'm just going to uh, use another GIF that I downloaded earlier. That is this fireplace GIF. And this is looking much better. Once you are happy with it, you can just close this um, customizing window. And here you have a GIF that is showing on the background. If you want, you can just test it by opening new tabs as well and here the gif would be shown so that's how you can customize your google screen in google chrome to show a gif on the background even though it is not uh, ideally supported by google chrome and this is the workaround that you can follow that's it for this video thanks for watching